In music, there are only 12 notes, which is nice because that makes it a lot easier to understand music theory. But it can seem like there are more than 12 notes because of what are called enharmonic note names, which are really just synonymous names for the same notes. For example, if you wrap the chromatic scale into a loop like this, you can see that there are 12 notes. C, D flat, D, E flat, E, F, G flat, G, A flat, A, B flat, and B, which is easy enough. All of the white keys have simple letter names, while all of the black keys are also labeled by letters along with extra flat symbols. But even with these extra flat symbols, there are still just 12 fundamental notes. Where it can get confusing though, is that the black keys, the flat notes, all have sharp names as well. So C sharp, for example, can also be called D flat, and D sharp sometimes goes by the name E flat, etc. And these other names or enharmonic labels can make it seem like there are more than 12 notes, but really there are still just 12 fundamental pitches. It's like if you had a group of 12 people and everyone was wearing a name tag, when you counted up the tags, it would be clear that the group had 12 people in it. But if some of the people wore two name tags, like if there was a guy named Jonathan, he had that as a tag, and then he was wearing a second tag, Captain, but you didn't know that that was that person's nickname, then you would logically assume that the group has more people than it really does. That is what's going on with the black keys in the chromatic scale, all of the sharp and flat notes. But where it gets a little crazy is with all of the other enharmonic note names as well. Because really every note in music goes by multiple names when you factor in what are called double sharp and double flat note names. But honestly, it's not that complicated. In this image, the different labels are arranged in concentric rings. Natural names, those without any sharps or flats, are at the center. These are all of the white notes in the chromatic scale. The ring of labels just outside of that includes all of the sharp names, all of the black notes, as well as B sharp, also known as C, and E sharp, aka F. The flat notes are a similar group with all of the black keys, along with C flat, also known as B, and F flat, aka E. The double sharps are all white notes. C double sharp, for example, is another name for D. D double sharp is another name for E, etc. And then finally, the double flats are also white, where E double flat is another name for D, D double flat is another name for C, and so on. But despite all of these synonymous or enharmonic names, there are really only 12 notes in music, and that's all. It's easy to get confused by all of these different labels, but there are really only 12 notes, and you can find a PDF with all of these diagrams in the community in my link tree.